channel or welcome to my channel if you're new my name is Sarah I thought today would be a good day to do what I eat in a day because it's the new year and I'm trying to get back on track and not eat as much junk food trying to create new habits that actually stick and not making unrealistic eating goals like salad for lunch and dinner and no processed foods and stuff like that just something that's more realistic and I'm also pescatarian. I eat fish like twice, once or twice a week. Just depends on if we go out a lot. That's usually what I get at restaurants here because we do live near the coast. So the seafood is really good. But yeah, it is nine o'clock right now. I usually have coffee before I have breakfast. And also I try to drink at least 16 ounces of water. I think this is 16 ounces, but you know, I try to drink all of that before I have coffee or food or anything else. Doesn't always happen, but that is one thing that I'm trying to get better at sticking to. I'm not really hungry for breakfast, but I am going to make coffee. So I always like to use dark roast. I have the Starbucks espresso roast. That's really good to make lattes with. And then the Sumatra. I just got this and tried it for the first time. I like it, but it's not my favorite, but I'm still going to drink it because it's not bad. But, and I have to make coffees this week instead of lattes because I forgot to get milk at the grocery store. So all I have is creamer and I don't like a lot of creamer in my coffee. So that's not enough to make a latte. Oops. And I don't really have hot coffee a ton. I just didn't prepare and make any coffee ice cubes this week or um, like I didn't brew it earlier and then put it in the freezer for it to get cold. So if I don't do that, the ice just melts way too fast. So I'm gonna use this silk sweet and creamy creamer that I got at Walmart. And I picked this up because I thought it looked good and it would like make the coffee look like that. And it does not, I don't really think it's worth the hype. Like it looks cute in the packaging and everything, but it's not that great. So I just do that much. And for this, I just squirt it a little bit. But see, like it's not foamy at all. It just kind of evaporates down into it for the most part. I feel like I'd be better off just making my own or just buying whipped cream. But I don't really worry too much about how much creamer I'm using in my coffee because I know I'm not using a ton because I don't like it really sweet. And then also, I don't track my calories. I just eat till I'm full and like eat when I'm hungry. Basically, whenever I drink coffee, I don't really get hungry till like 10 30 or 11. And so I'll have like a smaller breakfast and lunch. And then I like to have more at dinner because it just makes me sleep better whenever i'm like completely full so i usually drink my coffee and work a little bit and then i will see you guys when i eat breakfast <laughs> So I just made my oatmeal for breakfast. It's 10:15. So I just used cinnamon, maca powder, 
peanut butter, half of a banana, and frozen blueberries. And that's it. Oatmeal is definitely my number one go-to for breakfast because it's just easy and it's quick. And the ingredients are really cheap, so it's also like a really affordable meal instead of buying like fancy protein pancake mix or anything like that. And it keeps me really full. Okay, so it is almost one o'clock. I'm gonna go ahead and start making lunch. I'm not like super hungry yet, but I know I need to go ahead and eat or I'm gonna ruin dinner because I have this bad habit of waiting until like three o'clock to eat lunch and then I'm not hungry enough to make dinner. I think I'm just gonna do avocado toast since I'm not super hungry. So I always use um, Dave's Killer Bread unless we're out, but this is my favorite bread to make avocado toast with. I use the Good Seed or the Power Seed. That one's really good too. So just a little life hack. People probably already do this, but instead of scooping out the avocado and mashing it up, I just mash it up already in the shell. And it's like a little bowl. So you don't have to get a bowl dirty. And then I use onion powder and garlic powder and sea salt. And I just put it right into the shell. I guess that's what it's called. And then I just put the salt on top after I don't mix it in. But if I were really hungry, um, I would make eggs to go with it, but I don't want to waste them. Because then I will stuff myself to where I'm super full. So, got our avocado mashed. And I'm also going to go ahead and take my vitamins because I forgot to do that this morning. So, I take a prebiotic and probiotic and then B complex and calcium, magnesium, and zinc. So I'm gonna sit here and eat my lunch, but I wish we had honey to go in the tea, but we don't. And I'll probably get a snack later, maybe. We don't really have much snack food, but maybe like just a slice of cheese or something if I get hungry. Cause I might try to go work out at the apartment gym, so I definitely need to eat more than this. But I think for dinner, we're either gonna have burgers or pizza, so that will make up for not eating much throughout the day. But like I said, I really like to eat most of my food at night because coffee really suppresses my appetite throughout the day. But then as soon as like the nighttime hits, that's when I get like all my cravings and I get hungry. So my dinner meal is always a lot of food. And then I always like to have like a little sweet dessert or something. But I'll update you guys with what I have for dinner. Okay, so it's time for dinner. Billy isn't here yet, but he'll probably be here in like 20 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the pizza in the oven because I really want pizza. So I'll show you the kind of pizza that I like. And then most of the time we make it ourselves, but sometimes we just like to get the frozen. So this is the best pizza, like frozen pizza I've ever had other than like just normal, um, Red Baron, because Billy always gets Red Baron, so I usually get cheese because it's cheaper than this brand. This probably wasn't the best day to do a what I eat in day, but it's realistic. It's not like I planned it out or anything. I just kind of decided to do one today. And this is really what I usually eat. We don't eat frozen pizza every night. We eat it like once a week. I definitely do not make super healthy meals, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Like breakfast and lunch are pretty good, and then dinner is like semi-healthy. Uh, I was about to put the pizza in the oven. Don't put mine in. Okay, so I'm gonna have half of the pizza and then I'm gonna dip it in some ranch that I made yesterday. 
it's mainly um, light sour cream and then I add a little bit of mayonnaise to make it taste a little bit more like restaurant ranch but and then I put um, parmesan on it too so that concludes my what I eat in a day this was definitely just like random I didn't have anything planned but if you guys would like to see a more planned out like healthier what I eat in a day then give this video a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video